Raptor. Old steel Raptor. Don't flop on me. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right. Nice looking bass to kick it off. Way to start the day, man. Whew. All right, that got me pumping. Threw the fluke a few times and didn't get anything. Then I threw this over there. I didn't throw the fluke over there. I threw the fluke a couple times down this bank right here, working it through there and never got anything. And I threw this through there. He came out there and nailed it. I mean, that is, he's chubby too. It's a good looking smallmouth. First one of the day, way to kick it off. Got a little bit of a late start today. We're starting after lunchtime, but we'll try to do an afternoon float. I haven't done an afternoon float in a while, so we're gonna give it a try today. But first one, way to kick it off. That's a good looking smallmouth. Looks like he's been eating pretty good. Let's see if I can't get a measurement on him here real quick. If I can reach my measurement board here. Let's see what we got. 16 on the nose. Actually, about 16 and an eighth. But about 16th, good looking smallmouth. Let's get him back in the river. Good looking fish. Chunky. Here you go, big daddy. You're out of here. That's a pretty good one too. That baby bullgill. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. Yeah, that's a pretty good one. That last one's I yep, that yeah. last one I caught was like that. Probably pretty close to the same length, just, I mean, just full Old belly. Steel, buddy. That last one I caught was, all right, got that last one. one was, I... yep, baby that last one gill. I caught was like that. A little small mouth on the baby bullgill is about 15 and a half. It's got thick, too, he's got a, he's a thick fish. He's thick, got a full belly on him, 15 and a half. Good looking by second one of the day. Ooh. one mark. Say not a monster, but we'll sure take it. Decent little fish. Come back in the river. There you go, buddy. See you next time. Here, see if I can't get the other one real quick. 
think. There it goes. There it goes. Pop right out. Alrighty. Tangled up a little bit. Another little bitchy guy on the baby bullgill. Like I said, ain't very big. We'll take him again. There you go, buddy. See you next time. Set the hook. I didn't feel like I had a good hook set on him the way he came up and grabbed it there for the last second. Man, he is a big fish. Come on, baby. Look at that. Bam, yes. Woo! Yes. All right. Lay right there, man. Hang on right there, buddy. I'm going to get you loose here in just a second. All right. Man alive. Oof. What a fish. I don't know what he just puked up, but he got something thrown up there. Nasty. Oh my gosh, what did he throw up there? Crawfish. So I can get it in my pliers. He just puked up a gigantic crawfish. He just threw that up. A big old piece of crawfish. Spit it up everywhere. Oh, what a fish, man. He is a brute. That was a beautiful fish. I think this one could make nice 20. small mouth. Man, he's he a big, is a he's long, long fish. He is a long fish. fish. Could he's he make 20? Fish. He His mouth is closed. He came up, he followed him, and came up and hit it like right at the right section. Man, he has the right section. Came up and hit it, and he took it. We'll get some better pictures of him down here. The way the fish is marked up here, too. 19 and a quarter from the baby bullgill. Turn him loose. But we never fish it over there because you know you can't get to it. Right.